Hello, I'm Michaela. I'm a 5-1 sacral manifesting generator and I've responded to Lavina's request for a little testimonial about what it's been like to be in her professional presence over the last few years and how that's impacted my life and business. And I don't quite know where to start because I cannot for a second imagine what life would be like had I not been pulled to her. I, at the time, so back in 2019, I was feeling incredibly lost, not knowing who I am, which although my G center is defined as unconscious and me being a sacral manifesting generator, my sacral is actually, it goes through my G center up to my throat. And so it's, I'm actually here to, as a generator, know who I am and also to really be and embody and live who I am, what it's like to be a generator. And, um, and there's a potential for empowering others and, and, um, and being of a an agent of transformation for others. However, in 2019, I found myself in a place where I had basically shoulded myself. I had said yes to so many things because I felt like I should do. My not self mind was driving the show. And, um, and basically I was pretty laid out at the time. I followed a hashtag on Instagram, which I never normally do, which took me to a beautiful projector who had been through BG5. And so I responded to that without knowing that that's what I was doing. And then I went on to BG5 and responded to, to Lavina's voice. And I thought because I had my own business that I would, it was just logical, practical, um, that I would like continue the BG5 studies. That wasn't the case. I did the BG5 foundation with Lavina, and then my sacral responded to um, to go more over to the human design side. And I was really thrilled because I was still with Lavina, um, and I've been with Lavina ever since. I've gone through um, living your design. I became a living your design guide. I have done rave cartography, the ABCs, cartography. Um, and then into the professional analyst training. So PTL one and now PTL two, always with Lavina. And there's a part of my not self mind that says, mm, shouldn't I go, <laughs> shouldn't <laughs> I go and somewhere else. But the thing is, I really love receiving <clears throat> how Lavina transmits this information. She is very practical, which really, <clears throat> the practical, she's a three, five, the, the practical side of her really lands very well in my body. Um, I find her to be very caring to really be, it feels like she's very invested in, in me as a student that she's very invested in transmitting source material, um, which for me too, that, that that's a big value of mine. Um, She's funny. I love, she, she gives me permission to make mistakes and to learn from them and just to keep on adapting. I love her, um, how she has never stopped learning. And I love that then she turns around and, and, and then passes on what she's learnt to us. She's always adapting her materials. And so even though you, there's a potential that you could you know, take one course with her and then repeat it afterwards by auditing it, that course is never going to be the same. So always, of course, because the, the, the group is different, but especially because she's always refining, adapting the material to make it um, or well, better, to make it land better, to make it more practical, to make it um, more digestible, uh, more poignant. Um, yeah. And so although my not self mind says, why don't I go off to another teacher? My sacral just keeps on responding to, to, to the way that Lavina teaches and how that has had an impact her and human design on my life 
and business is that it's just turned everything around. So remember me saying in the beginning that I am this 51 Sacral Manifesting Generator and I have these channels up through the G and I'm here to know myself and then to embody and be myself. That changes everything. That changes everything in life and business. It's changed how I parent. It's changed my relationship. It's changed the way I am in business. Um, it's an ever-evolving, ever-deepening process, of course. But I was not attracted to Ra Uruhu in the first place. It was Lavina's voice that I responded to. And now I can listen to Ra, but I needed the filter of Lavina's voice and the way she delivers the information. And let's not forget that she's a projector. Let's not forget that hugely important part. And, and what I feel, even though I haven't gone to other people for teachings, what I really strongly feel inside of me is that I, through training with Lavina, have had access to the, um, to in, to, information to training because she cares so much and because she's so attached to the source material and and always delivering um always refining always experimenting always um adapting changing it the way the delivery of it i feel like i am getting like some of the best training that could possibly exist out there. It's young, it's fresh, um, it's fun, and it's deeply caring and transformative. <laughs> so that's it. Bye-bye.